My name is Katie Buttlemeyer. I'm a sophomore at Ohio State studying environmental science, and I'm a research intern here at Hershey. At Sochi, I've been able to use my environmental science major to help me research a lot of different topics. I've also been connected with a lot of environmental programs and companies in the region. I am planning to be in international development and so she has helped me figure this out as they've connected me with a lot of international development companies, also environmental science programs in the region, and they've also given me hands-on experience researching some of these international development topics. I have the freedom to do things at my own pace and time. I can make my own schedule and I can work independently. I would tell students to start early because the earlier that you start looking for an internship, the more competitive you are later. I would also say to pick an internship that is something of your passion because even if you're making less money than an internship that like isn't in your passion, you're going to have priceless information and know if you actually like what you're getting into. What brought me to Sochi is I was in high school. I knew that I wanted to be like competitive going into college and I wanted to have like a leg up on everybody else who was applying. So I thought, you know, like let's get an internship. That looks really good. And so I joined Sochi. And now that I'm in college, I've kept this internship because I'm learning a lot of those base soft skills that you don't really get taught. I mean, now I know how to work a printer and like make copies and stuff. So I think it's given me like really good practical skills for like long term, which is why I'm still here. So one of the projects that I'm particularly proud of is actually really recent. I was asked to make a list of all the research involving environmental science, biology, and related topics in the Dayton region. So all of our consortium of colleges, I looked through, I looked at all their research that's going on, and I made a list so that way research scientists don't overlap study topics. And it actually has really helped me get connected with all the research going on in my region, so it's really cool. I guess one of the biggest things that I've learned is my communication. My communication was lacking before, and it really, like, put me on a schedule because once you start communicating with other people, you start checking up on that email daily, you learn like what it's like to be in a real job. And so I think that's like probably my biggest improvement, but also like the biggest learning curve that I've had to deal with.